Hey everyone, what is going on? It is Memory here. We're here, everyone, ladies and gentlemen, for the sixth episode of Golden Kamui. And I would do it today, but if you maybe you can tell, my throat is feeling a little weird, and I'm not trying to like jeopardize all oh, this reaction. I want to actually, you know, put this video out. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, the sixth episode of Golden Kamui. We had uh, Naihei, I think his name was, at the end of the previous episode, which it felt kind of weird how they kind of threw in his introduction. Like at the very end of of the episode, I was you know hoping. I think it would have been a lot better if they kind of saved it for this episode. But I think the majority of this episode still will be focused on him uh, or around him. But I just the way they left it off at the end of the previous episode was kind of weird, uh, and I would have much rather it been saved. You know that part, that little part for you know this whole episode, and then whatever else we're gonna get in here. But you know we'll live. It's not like the biggest deal, right? But we're going to get into this episode, everyone, and see what we got. We're at the very beginning, zero seconds, and we're going to start here in three, two, one, play. Hey, those bears ain't getting none. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> See, that's the thing. Like with him in the, at the end of the previous episode, like he looked like this kind of this very serious. Like he doesn't look like he'd come off as like a Surumi or like you know one of them who's psychotic. But this guy is probably a little psychotic in his own way too. <laughs> that's just the villains, or not even villains, all the characters in this series. It's killed two hundred similar. You know those habits in and out will help you. And th that's what I was like, a Serpa has to know this guy, like somehow, or they, they have to maybe know each other. I, I, maybe it's a long shot, but. Retar? Hunter <laughs> Souls. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about, dude. Like, this guy came across as, like, maybe the most serious character we've had, like, you know, in this series so far at the end of the previous episode. But then, like, that, it's like, oh, he's just like any other character in this damn show, man. Um, I love it, though. I love it. I don't, I don't mind it one bit. <laughs> Anger, know that there is great life there. The world is painted in dark gray. <laughs> Your knee going down to reach somewhere together from there we will find out the truth mm -hmm. on the winding road Here we go, Hunter Souls. Yeah, it is gonna be more centered on uh, Naihe. Oh, <laughs> yo, that is dope. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> He's going about it a different way, but oh, what the? <laughs> this man's crazy. What is he doing? That could have been really bad. Jeez. 
Oh, missed it. Yeah, another time. <laughs> but a surf is like so similar to just to Nai, like the you know the way you know they know about like you know hunting in the the wilderness and certain. That's why I feel like they they have to know each other. Like I, I even think a Serpa, if I remember correctly, was like talking about some kind of hunter in the previous episode. I have a bad memory sometimes, but <laughs> the more <laughs> the bloodier it tastes. Like that sounds great. <laughs> Yo, I'm telling you, man. Shokugeki no Kamui. <laughs> it gets so big it pulls a hole in there. <laughs> this guy is a trip. See, that's... Oh, my God. <laughs> I much prefer his character like this and him being like a serious ass... You know, he, even that alone wasn't... Now, I didn't mind that, but just this kind of the way he is, like <laughs> the way he really is. Maybe born again and. I never said that to anyone I killed in that war. Damn. All right, so these two are kind of working in tandem. That's kind of... <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, you learn something new every day. I guess I know how to say boner now. Like, <laughs> Oh. Oh, my. Jeez. Limbs flying everywhere. Bodies flying everywhere. Like... I figured, yeah, it was a nightmare, but, like, damn, dude. You'll get that when you've been in wars like that or a war like that. A lot of people do, and it's it's sad. <laughs> the PTSD. Oh, dude, what if they run across the same deer that Sugimoto and Serpa are? Oh, shit. That'd just be a crazy coincidence. <laughs> yeah, like, it's all over the place. Poor deer. <laughs> That's already suffered for quite a bit, but... <laughs> Yeah, and the, and the way he's been able to train this dog, like, 
I mean, we saw right in front of the the bear the bear cave, the bear hole or whatever. Like I was like, this dog is like insane. Like, Yeah, so is it the wolf? Why is he dragging the dog like that? It's, it's kind of fucked up, man. Like, I mean, the dog doesn't want to go, obviously, but like, jeez. Oh, here we go. This is like the most epic, like, deer chase, like, hunting deer scene ever. Oh, what the? It's about a, oh, <laughs> holy shit! Oh, there's Retar. Yeah. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad because Nahe and Tanagaki are like so close. I mean, he just said they're in the wolf's territory, but. Yeah, dude, like, look at, look at that. Oh, I didn't even really notice that. I thought that was maybe just, like, blood flying out, like, out from the side of it, but it's actually, like, frozen solid, like. Dude, oh, that's sad. No, you hate to. See. I, I, I don't like. Yeah, you got to do what you have to do to survive, like especially with their situation. But you know, there's there are people there are people out there who just go out to you know hunt deer like just to kill them. Like they're not trying to like survive out in the wilderness or anything. Like they just go out. Yeah, we're gonna go hunt deer and just and we'll shoot them and kill them and for. <laughs> you know, they could easily have any other kinds of food, right? But. You know, going into their territory, into, you know, where they live, like. So kind of sad. But yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do. For them, at least. Like, in their situation. Oh, snap. Oh. <laughs> dude, he's carrying the whole leg, dude. Like... Come on, you can't, you can't, like, just, just how serious it was, and then he's holding up the deer head, like, <laughs> they're, like, making a joke out of it, like, The dog's still shaking, like. <laughs> huh? <laughs> this man gay? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's what. I don't think Tanagaki's thinking, but <laughs> I guess to you know wipe you know any scent off of them or whatever, like <laughs> sure, I see. <laughs> he was a trip in the previous episode, dude. When he slipped in like the room and he like fell over, it was just like this, like yo. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> <laughs> this
This is, yeah, this good time isn't gonna last too too much longer though. <laughs> Get Sugimoto's face, dude. <laughs> oh. <laughs> They're all like waste right now. <laughs> An immortal Sugimoto, bitch. Mother, mother, mother. Jesus Christ, dude, what is happening right now? Dude, she's still like sticking her head out, like sticking half of her body out the way. Jeez. Dude, the way they can get me so good with the comedy, but then also, like, you know, be like this about, you know, serious about certain matters, like, in the, the main premise of the story, right? It's like... The Paul Trader's had a name they gave him out of fear. And, and that's him. Yep, yep. <laughs> Small because of the cold, he's just much bigger than it. <laughs> Dude's talking, he's like talking about his dick like this whole episode. <laughs> so he has tattoos as well, like. She's heard that name before. Pull her out. <laughs> ah, I thought they were gonna like. I thought he meant they were gonna wash each other, but <laughs> I guess they didn't do that. But also, this is what the serpo was just talking about. <laughs> As well. <laughs> Dude. What a sap. <laughs> so even with the police, like right here. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh my god. It Totally turned his like whole head around. It's ideal end. Damn. Talking about Retar. Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, no. And, dude, what's Nihei is, like, <laughs> we just, you know, we we see it. We we know it. What's this man is set out on his, on his prey? He's, he's going to do whatever it takes to, you know, get it. <laughs> It's crazy, but I love it. I love him too. He's, you know, like all these characters are great. I mean, <laughs> are you kidding me? Look at the censorship on this, dude.
I mean, just like a, a lot of these characters, Surumi, Hijikata, you know, uh, yeah, right here. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna, this guy's it's the fourth or fifth time he's talked about his damn dick. <laughs> horny, the horny hunter, <laughs> Nihei Tetsuzo. <laughs> The last fire made with wolf droppings there will ever be in Japan. This dude is something. <laughs> he's just as insane as a Surumi, dude. Like, they're gonna kind of keep their distance or separate. Oh, they're on to him. This is about to get insane. Oh, there's Red Tar. Oh, oh shit. Shit, I have to control my boner. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> oh, oh my god. Dude, that missed him by like that much. Oh, and Sugimoto's right here. Perfect, perfect. Dude, next episode is going to be unreal. <laughs> oh, I forgot about his damn dog. Oh, shit. Oh, ooh, ooh, his fingers. Oh, damn! <laughs> he just ate that sh <laughs> Yo! Dude. Oh my god, they are gonna... S Dude, they would save that for the next episode, man. Like, they shouldn't even show me any little bit of that fight right there. They should have just saved all that for the next episode, dude, because now I like, I'm like, ah, Dude, like, Tsukimoto cut off a few of his fingers, man. Did you see that? Like, and then, ah, uh, For, for, for Nahid is still, like, <laughs> Even you know, attempt it, you know, hit him with his gun. Like he did hit him with his gun, but Sugimoto just ate that shit. Like it was, that was nothing to him. <laughs> uh, but a uh, Serpa man, she came in the clutch right there at the end. I, I don't even know what that was. It was like a bucket or something. She, sh you know, she shot with her bow that I think gave Retar the notice to you know get out of there before he. We saw it like it was that close. It was that close to hitting Retar. Like, dude, <laughs> too close, too close. Um. Uh, but damn, what an episode! I I love Nahe. I I love Nahe. He is he's he's awesome. I mean, just the uh, the kind of hunter he is, right? But then also, you know, because I thought he was gonna be like this serious. I mean, how he was shown at the end of the previous episode, like this serious, like you know, really talented. You know, he knows what he's doing, hunter. But he does have a funny kind of quirk to him, especially you know, talking about boners and his dick and his, yeah. So there's that part to him. But he's just as insane as these other characters, man. He's just as insane as a Sugimoto, as a Surumi, as a Hijikata. Like they, they, the characters in this are just so great, dude. <laughs> Complication next episode. So we're gonna see what happens with this, this uh, fight between Sugimoto, a Serpa and, and crew, uh, Shirashi. Uh, Retar and uh, Tanagaki and uh, Naihei. So, which Tanagaki is like further down the 
like the the mountain. Like he was, you know, down in like the he was down low. Nahe was up top. He was like down low kind of. So Retar is running away. So that leaves, you know, I I, I mean I would assume that uh, Tanagaki kind of has maybe opportunity to to shoot Retar if he's going to. I'm I'm not sure, but you know we didn't see him at the end there. Last time we saw him was he was like down low, like kind of in the ridge or whatever. So I mean we'll see what happens as a whole in the next episode. But as a whole, uh, like I said, this one was was fantastic. I mean the comedy was there once again. It always is there with Golden Conway. You know we had uh, our our Food Wars you know esque episode as well. Like I mean this is I, I've said it before. Like this is like almost better than Food Wars. <laughs> Legit like Shokugeki no Kamui man. Like it's, it's it's awesome. It's awesome what they do with it. But then it can also be serious and focus on its main you know story, the main premise and. Uh, you know, with the with the tattoos and the and the gold and all that. So, the, the way they mix it all together is is great, and they did a good job of that in this episode. So, uh, as always, they do a good job of it. So, yeah, let me know what you guys thought of this sixth episode of Golden Comedy, everyone. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Peace.